Hi everyone, uh, in this video series we'll be looking at how to convert um, high frequency data to low frequency data. I mean how to convert uh, yearly data to quarterly data or to monthly data or to weekly data or to daily data. Okay, so when we say high frequency data we're talking about uh, quarterly data, monthly data, weekly data. When we're talking about low frequency data, we're talking about yearly data. So perhaps you have a study you would love to conduct and the study would uh, would make more sense using a uh, high frequency data. And then you have uh, a low frequency data, yearly data. How then do you convert uh, yearly data to quarterly data or monthly data? That is what this video is all about. Okay, but before we proceed, please uh, just look down below and click click on the subscribe button. I would really appreciate that. Okay. Uh, okay, let's get to work. Uh, you come here. The first thing to do is come here and come and create a page to accommodate the new series you want to generate. Okay, so you come here. Uh, sorry for this one. You come here. Specify frequency range. Okay, we want to. Uh, create a quarterly data from a yearly data. So you click on quarterly. Okay, you click on OK. And then you come back to the first page. Uh, let's say we want to convert this time uh, ESI. Okay, you should uh, mind you, this is a yearly data. Okay, let me open it for you to see. You see, yearly data 1985 to 2018. Okay, so you come here, you right click, and then you copy. When you copy, come back to the new page you've created, and then you right click and you paste special. Okay, when you paste special, you come to this dialog box and you say low frequency to high frequency method. You come and uh, choose the method you would prefer to uh, convert your series from yearly to quarterly. Okay, we do use specified in source, constant, quadratic. Okay, let's say we are going for specified in source. Okay, by way of example, uh, for the record, you should know the uh, the behavior of your variable to determine which of this method will suit. Okay, uh, the splitting of your series in, from uh, uh, into quarterly data. So you come here and click on OK. The OK, you have your data generated. Your data has been converted to quarterly data. If you come here and click on the SI. What do you see? You see 1985 quarter one to let's say. Uh, come down here 2018 quarter 4 so we have converted from yearly data to quarterly data okay we can also do for monthly data the same step okay let me show you that too come and create a new page okay uh, click on this specify frequently and then uh, this time around we are going for monthly data so come for monthly okay you have uh, a list of options there whether you want it semi-annually whether you want it bi-monthly fortnightly okay you have them there just pick one so monthly, uh, monthly, yeah, and then you click on, uh, click on, okay. You see, you have uh, a page that is uh, scheduled to take monthly data. So you come back here, you right click and copy, copy, and then you come back to the new page you have created, and then uh, you pay special. So you come here and determine which of the method you would use for the conversion, okay. Mm, for this uh, exercise, I'm just going to click on specified in source and then you click on uh, OK. When you click on this, you have monthly series 1985, uh, month 1 to uh, 19, 2018, uh, 2018 month off. You see, we have converted it from a monthly series to uh, from a yearly series to monthly series. Oh, then uh, we can also convert from um, uh, high frequency data to low frequency data. I mean, we can convert this monthly series back to yearly series. Okay, just come to this the new page and uh, specify and frequency. And then we are converted back to annual annual series. And then you click on OK. You click on OK. Come back here. Yeah. Remember, this is a monthly series. Okay, we want to convert it back to annual series. Just right click, copy, and you come here. And paste special so high frequency high, high to low frequency method which of the method would you use would you like to use for the conversion that is left it's left to you so oh uh, specified in source I will go for that and I click on ok oh, ok that's right if you come here and click what do you see 
which is converted back to TL series. TL series. Okay, so this is how to convert data to do your data conversion. Okay, maybe from a low frequency to high frequency, or from high frequency to low frequency. Okay, thank you, thank you for watching. Please, uh, before you leave this channel, please do go to click on the subscribe button and encourage this channel. Thank you.